What's up you guys and welcome to my channel. I am Corby, your beauty, health, and lifestyle guru. If you guys are new, go ahead and click that subscribe button because I don't know what you're doing. You should have already been a part of this family, but it's okay because my door is always open. This video is going to be a part of my favorites. I've never done a favorites video and this will be my very first. So I want to be able to do give you guys my honest opinions on certain products that I have used that were makeup products as well as skincare products, but pretty much all beauty products at this point. I put together a list of little snip box and I packed it all in this Sephora bag <laughs> of all the products that I wanted to go ahead and include in my 2017 favorites. So, let's go ahead and get this started. I do not want to make this video very long. Let's go ahead and get started with all of the goodies in the bag. I'm going to start off with skincare products because lately, this month, I did not wear a lot of makeup because it's been extra hot. And I don't know about you, but sometimes I just get into the mood where when I'm hot, I don't feel like doing nothing. I'm ready to just go ahead and run on out the house. But sometimes when I do have to go somewhere important, I try to at least do some makeup. But in the meantime, in order for you to have great makeup and wear great makeup, you have to make sure you take care of your skin. So lately, my skin has been on is a freaking game. Kudos to you, skin. And yes, I have had a minor breakout like Right here, I've had a breakout. I've had some breakouts underneath my chin, but that's because I've been ODing on the grease lately. Sorry about that. And I think my body knows it now. Like, I know what to eat and what not to eat that's going to make me break out and what's going to make me be okay. But for the most part, that's pretty much where all of my breaking out has come from. And we all know when that time of the month comes around, our hormones do some funny stuff and our skin just be acting all crazy. But... Let's go ahead and start off with some skincare. So I'm going to start off with face and then I'll work my way on down because I do have some body products in here that I'm obsessed with because not only do we need to take care of our face, but we also need to take care of our skin overall. Let's start with our face. If you guys are familiar with my influencer products, I know you guys already know if you um, that I've received certain free products that I had to test out and review, basically. Now, in the midst of me testing these products out, I actually really tested these products out. And a lot of these products that they did send me, except for one, and that's just hair care, but we're not going to deal with hair care right now. That will actually be a separate video. For my face washes, oh my goodness, you guys already know my holy grail. Old Hemrickson. Okay, I am obsessed with this freaking face wash. This face wash is the face wash from the gods, like for real. This stuff has completely controlled the oil balance on my face because it does say oil control cleanser. Yeah, it definitely does exactly what it says. Now, I was sent the toner as well as the moisturizer. But if you guys watch my previous video on what happened to those products, they did get thrown away. Um, unfortunately, when I went to the when I was late for my flight, I had to throw those products away. But I went back out and I actually bought this product. So this is actually mine. I actually bought this with my own money, and this is retails for the price of twenty three dollars, I believe. It is expensive when it comes to face washes for those who really are like, you know, I don't really think it's important to spend that much money on face washes. You guys, this is worth every penny. I'm telling you right now, if you have problems with oily skin and large pores, this is your holy grail. I promise it will not only control your oil, but it will start closing your pores. And your skin is going to start glowing. So, shout out to Old Hemrickson. This is actually my very first product that I'm obsessed with. The next product. I started recently using the peel-off mask. The cold, I think this is the purifying peel-off mask that has been this huge fad. Everybody does this peel-off mask. And I wanted to try it because I've had issues with blackheads all over my nose for God knows how long. And I used to just think that my nose was made that way. Because I didn't know what blackheads were. I didn't know that my nose wasn't supposed to look like a natural strawberry. I didn't know that. It just always looked like that to me. Until I used the peel-off mask. Now, this is just an off... I'm not going to say an off-brand. This is just a different brand. I bought this from out of my local beauty supply store because it was something that a lot of people were raving about in the beauty supply store at the time. And they were like, girl, you need to try that. I was like, really? What? I think I need to try it then. So 
I went ahead and I tried it. I mean, it was nothing but five bucks, you guys. Like, it's literally four ninety nine. Y'all already know. I keep boxes to everything, but my product was definitely in the box. But it comes in this little little um, tube right here. Um, it is not a lot of product in here because I've noticed that I have used this product a lot. Uh, I mean, you know I'm just saying. The first time I used this product. I did not know what to think because I was a little afraid. I really went by the rules. You're only supposed to keep it on for 20 to 30 minutes. I left it on for about 30 minutes. And I wasn't sure how much I was supposed to put on. Because I felt like it was too thin in order for me to really peel it off. If y'all know what I mean. So I kind of gotten to the point where I know just enough amount to just put it up there so I can be able to peel it off with no problems. But y'all, when I say I peel that baby off, I was like. all crazy but I did see all of that nasty black hands peel up all of that nasty impurities out of my pores that have been like making life in my pores living its whole life in my face I can't deal so this product or any other type of mask peel I highly suggest to anyone if you're going to do a facial scrub I highly suggest that you at least scrub your face two to three times a week and at least do a peel off mask twice a week and that is just going to basically purify your face and help detox your face when it comes to all of that nasty oils and dirt build up. Even when you do wash your face, it's still that build up over time with dead skin and deep, deep, deep down in your pores. So please make sure that you guys do a mask as well as a scrub and you'll be just fine when it comes to great and healthy skin. Please drink your water as well. That's another July favorite. All summer long. I drank water like it was my life, but that's the only thing I drank anyway. But you guys, please, oh please, make sure that you drink a lot of water. Your whole entire body depends on it. Your body is made up of 70% of water. Please make sure that you replenish yourself for real. Next product that I do want to bring to you all's attention, which is... I hate when that comes out. And these both actually came from Influencer. I think I have like a few products in here that I've gotten from Influencer that made it favorite because I can, I'm obsessed with these products, like completely obsessed with these products. But this is the Julep Boost Your Radiance Reparative Rosehip Seed Facial Oil. You guys, if you guys are friends with me on Facebook, you, I mean, excuse me, Facebook, well, yeah, Facebook too. Facebook and Instagram and Snapchat, you already know. This facial oil is my holy grail. Since the moment that I've got this stuff and I was starting to try it, it has left my face feeling very moisturized and soft and hydrated. And I cannot go a day without using this product. Two drops is enough. You do not need no more than two drops. I drop the drops on my face and I moisturize it into my skin and I press it into my skin. I make sure that it is deep down into my pores. I make sure that it's deep down into my skin because... Y'all, this stuff not only smells good. Look at this. I'm out I'm halfway through this. This doesn't make no sense. This is probably going to last me like maybe two more months. But this product retails for the price of $46, I do believe. And it is worth every penny. And I was asked, will I go out and purchase this product outside of receiving it for free? Yes, I would. I would totally spend my 45 bucks on this because it is worth every penny. I am, I've never been in love with a facial oil before in my life because for people who have oily skin, you think that you should stay away from oils, which is not even the case. You're actually supposed to apply oil on top of your oil in order for the oils in your face to not produce more oil to make up for the oil that is lacking. Ah, makes sense, doesn't it? The next product I'm going to be talking about is the Dermalogic Stress Positive Eye Lift. This product right here is bomb. But one thing I really do like about it, which I didn't really get a chance to really talk about it too much, but it's the fact of the packaging. You guys, look at the packaging. This is so stinking cute. If you saw my previous video on my Influencer unboxing box, you guys already know how obsessed I am when it comes to packaging. This is so cute. I just love this stuff. But this is a really, really easy tube. You can put this in your purse. You can put this in your travel bag. You don't really have to carry the whole entire box. 
But I love this because I love this easy too. It is, it's so easy to place this on my eye. Just push out enough product and rub it right into my skin. You don't necessarily have to use your finger. I know I do because I like to press it into my skin, which you can still do with this. But to me, I love skin to skin. But for anybody, you really don't. So it's easy for you to just go ahead and even when you're in the car, at, when you're at work, and you just need that extra protection underneath your eyes because sometimes we stress out a lot and some and stress can bring about bags and wrinkles and dark marks underneath your eyes nobody has time for that so lately i have noticed that it has brightened up the dark marks under my eyes eliminate some of the bags underneath my eyes i know i don't sleep a lot but this definitely plays camouflage i think that's pretty much it when it comes to my facial products the next thing I'm going to talk about is skin products that I actually love and I became obsessed with. And I found myself using this almost every day this month. Like, almost every day this month. And that is going to start off with my body scrub. So, you guys, I don't know if you guys are familiar with Victoria's Secret smoothing scrub washes. Y'all, and to semi, the semi-annual time, I stock up. Because I already know. This stuff right here... I am obsessed with, and I am obsessed in the, in the fragrance Rose. I love everything Rose. Rose Gold, Rose Red, Rose Pink, Rose Red, Rose White, Rose Royce. This summer, I body scrubbed a lot because I love that natural glow. I wanted to reveal the natural glow of my skin. Shedding all that extra dead skin. Like, nobody wants that dead skin that's been packed up over the winter time. We ain't trying to hibernate no more. It's time to reveal our beautiful skin. And so, with that being stated, it is kind of important, not only for your face, but for your body, too, to scrub your body at least two to three times a week. So, this body scrub from, Vic from Victoria's Secret is really good. I love the smell of it. It's just, oh my goodness, this stuff is so amazing. I'm actually getting ready to go wash it up, take a shower in a minute, and I'm going to go ham in this. But I come to find out that I, not only do I love this scrub, but it is very well paired up with the Bath & Body Works Mad About You. Y'all, this is a straight old school. I used to, sh I used to shower with this back in the day. And I haven't used this in a long time, but for this month, I've been craving this smell because these two combined together, not even a part of the same brand, but these two combined together is like peanut butter and jelly. It has to go together. This smell is like a very feminine, very romantic, very aggressive woman in power, seduction smell. Like, I don't even know how to explain it, but I just, I'm obsessed with the two smells together. These right here, baby, bomb.diggity com. I love using Bath & Body Works shower gels because it has shea butter and vitamin E oil already in it. My skin doesn't feel like it's super dry. Once I rinse off the shower gel, like off of my body, it doesn't feel dry. It doesn't feel sticky. It doesn't feel anything at all. Like it feels very smoothing, soothing, and I still smell it on my body once I pop out. And at least my bathroom's smelling all cute and stuff. So, after that, I do, I have not been using lotions this summer. I do not do a whole lot of lotions. I do a lot of um, oils and body, pretty much body oils. However, you guys, a friend of mine from work, my sister creates body butters and lotions and all types of body scrubs and all this organic stuff. And... I have become obsessed with her products. I will put her information in the description box below. You guys have to. And what I mean you have to, you have to hit her up. Because these her products is so amazing that a little bit literally goes a long way. So you could stock up on her products and still be straight forever. Her products are chemistry products. And it is, it's spelled K-I-M-I-S-T-R-Y. Chemistry, because I do believe her name is Kim. And she placed the little containers right here. And when I say, you guys, I'm about almost finished with this. This is body butter. I started using this as soon as I got it. And I do believe that I got it in the beginning of July. And when I say a little bit, literally goes a long way. I use this all over my body, except for my face, because I don't, I, 
very sensitive when it comes to my face. But I use it literally everywhere. And this is in the, the fragrance Coco Mango. Bruh, I've had so many compliments. Literally every day. People will come, you smell so good. Your skin feels so good. You look glowy because not only does it moisturize your skin and gives you a nice fragrance, but it makes your skin glow. Like, it glows out your skin like nobody's business. So, I'm obsessed with this product right here. I actually got two because they were two for, oh, Jesus Christ. They were two for $12. These are very inexpensive, too, because they're only six bucks. What? They're very, they're very affordable. So, like I said, I will place her stuff in the description box below. If you subscribe to her website, she will send you a free sample. So, if you're not really sure what to get yet and you just want to try something, I highly suggest that you try the free sample of Coco Mango. You will not be disappointed. You will be obsessed. And everyone else around you will be too. You will not get people off of you. You will be like, look, can you stop smelling me? For real. So, speaking of smelling good and personal hygiene... You guys, I am one of them people who cannot stand funky, funky, funky underarm people. I'm so sick of people trying to hug me and you stink. Like, stop it. I have come across um, this deodorant from Secret. You guys, if you are not familiar, I need you to get your funky friends on the game, okay? It is the Secret pH Balance Shower Fresh Deodorant. Sis and bro. This right here will go for a man and a woman and a child. Y'all cannot go wrong with this stuff right here. Even when you're in active use and you're moving around all day, your underarms and your body will smell super fresh. It doesn't even make any sense. I worked out twice in one day with this same freaking deodorant just to test it out. And my underarms still smell fresh. Fresh as I don't know what. Please. Oh, please. If you guys are going to get any type of deodorant, I highly suggest that you try the Secret pH Balance Shower Fresh. I love this deodorant. This deodorant even leaves my clothes smelling amazing. I wish I could just chop some of it off and put it in my detergent because it really smells good. I wonder if Game could team up with Secret and get this fragrance and put it in a laundry detergent. For real. Because... Y'all, this stuff, I could just, I could smell this all day. It smells absolutely amazeballs. And that's that. If you guys have watched my previous video, which I will probably place right up here in the icon for my cards, the influencer box that I used, that I unboxed with Kat Von D, used the, actually I started using the same one just a little bit this month, and I haven't really, really been big on it because I have went back to using my Adidas, which you guys have already seen in my video. I had mentioned before that I had used my Adidas before. I love this Adidas perfume. I'm not a huge fan of perfume, and like I said before, but this perfume right here aids right into this. You guys, this is literally all you need in your life, for real. And, and it is ironic that all of these <laughs> that are pink, but... I'm not even a huge pink fan, but, but honey, the, that right there, that little trio will rule your life. It will save your life. You're going to be walking around here smelling fresh as I don't know what. The next thing that I want to talk about are makeup products. So makeup products that I do have, and I'm kind of want to speed through these really quickly because these are some of the products that you have seen me use in my tutorials. So I'm not really going to go in depth with these just like how I did my other ones. So I'm just going to kind of speed up through this because I'm looking at the time and it is like, time to go. So first I'm going to start off with, I'm just going to start pulling out random stuff to be honest with you. I want to start with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance Make Eyeshadow Palette. This is my favorite eyeshadow palette. I promise you, I use this eyeshadow palette every day, literally every day. I don't know why I was so late to the game and getting this palette, but I'm glad that I jumped on the bandwagon because this is my holy grail. I take this everywhere, like everywhere, because you never know when you need an eyeshadow moment. It's like I have this pot, this palette along with seven other lipsticks and five lip liners and maybe two eyeliners in my purse because you never know when you're going to need a nice beat moment. I don't know. Tyra Banks might show up and be like, look, I'm trying to run this show one more time and I'm trying to be the host. Ooh, shit. I 
next next product that I have been obsessed with is my NARS foundation. I'm actually using it right now as we speak. And it is in the, in the color Cuba Medium 3. This is the Velvet Matte Skin Tint Broad Spectrum with SPF 30 sunscreen in it. So it is really great to use in the summertime to protect your skin. Yay! Oh, I love this foundation. And it is, it's buildable coverage. So a little, I start off with a sheer base because my skin has been doing so well lately. I don't really need full coverage anymore. The only time that I really pay attention to full coverage is when I'm having like a bad acne moment. But when my skin is pretty decent, I can go light to, light to medium coverage and still be fine. Like right now, I'm really light to medium coverage. I'm barely, I literally don't even have a lot of makeup on today. And that's one thing I love about that. Another thing that I really obsessed with and is my e.l.f. Primer! And this is in the Illuminating Face Primer. This is in the color Radiant Glow. Obsessed, 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 obsessed. The next thing I do want to talk about is my Sasha Buttercup Setting Powder. I was, I remember I was so debating if I was going to do the Laura Mercier or the Sasha Buttercup. And I ended up going with the Sasha Buttercup because it does kind of aid in a yellow undertone. And I have a yellow undertone, so I really wanted to try that one out, especially winging out from Midnight luxury banana powder that's what i was using before and i actually really love the sasha buttercup a lot better too better than the ben Nye banana powder because of the consistency it's a lot smoother and it's a lot finer than the uh that other product and it doesn't feel as chalky another product that i do want to talk about is my uh -huh, lippy max i have gotten the mac lip scrub recently this month and this is in the, this is in Sweet Brown Sugar. I love some brown sugar when it comes to my freaking lips. I'm telling you, when I used to make my own lip scrubs, it used to be brown sugar, sugar, and Vaseline. Sometimes I would put olive oil in it, and I just used to just scrub my lips. So this wasn't that far off, but I did want to try theirs because I wanted something that I could just keep in a little tube like this, even though I could have made it my own self. But I wanted to try it out. I wanted to try theirs and I wanted to see how it was going to work for my lips because a lot of people were raving about it and saying that it gave you like a silky feel when it came to your lips. And y'all, this stuff right here really does give your lips like a very, very silky base type of feel. And I'm obsessed with it. But the last few products that I am going to talk about is my highlight. This is my highlighter. And this is by, oh, I dropped some stuff. This is by Cueva, Cuevaca. And if you guys are already familiar, I am obsessed with the Billion Dollar Babe Highlighter. This highlighter is my freaking holy grail. I don't, I think this might be in my July favorites all this September, October, November, December, Jet, back to the next year all over again. Because this highlight is life. So obsessed am I, and it is actually owned by Black Owned Businesses. The next other product that I just want to, oh geez, please, I'm just dropping stuff, that I do want to talk about is my brow food. You guys, I love this brow food. It is very easy, especially when I'm traveling on the go and I'm trying to go ahead and beat my face in a car. The only thing you really need, like for real, for real, it's very easy to use and it allows your your Eyebrows to last literally all day long without smudging, moving, smearing. It will not move at all. The last two products that I do want to talk about are my lippies. And these are my two favorite lips that I have been using almost every day. And it is by ColourPop. And these are Stingray and I do believe this is Razor by My My Ray Ray. These are a part of her collection. She did these are discontinued. I do apologize, but these are my favorite, and I cannot repeat it anymore, and I cannot express it anymore. Right now, obsessed, like literally obsessed. And that's pretty much it when it comes to my August, July slash August favorites. <laughs> <laughs> because I clearly forgot what month we were in, and that is totally my fault. But all I know is I've, I've been on these products for a minute, and I have been using these products consistently, so I know that they do work. I hope that this video was kind of more so of fun and informative for you guys, because I wanted you guys to just be able to figure out what, should, what I want to use next. What is something that I have not tried yet? What is something that... I want to try, but I've been not really sure because I haven't seen it on anyone else and I haven't really seen if anybody really likes it, honestly. And all of these products, I 100% live by. 
I love every last one of these products and I swear by them and I promise you, you will too. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys are not already subscribers, like I said in the previous part or in the beginning, go ahead and click that subscribe button. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and click that thumbs up. If you want a detailed video on my hair as well as makeup and clothes, go ahead and place it in the comment box below and go ahead and click that thumbs up button so I know that you guys really do want that tutorial. Thank you guys so much for watching. Remember, God is love, so love, love. Bye! And it gives me a good chance to be a woman. I don't want to see you. I don't want to see you now. And I know what it means to be covered in good music that you never